Hello and assalamualaikum guys. Today we are going to be learning about the select case. So let us get started. Basically, what is select case? Select case is similar to the nested if, but it is really easy to manage. Let us see. Let us suppose that we have. Uh, So we have a basic program says that if the value we input is Ali, then it's going to say welcome Mr. Ali. And if we put input something other than Ali, that would be case else, it's going to say incorrect username. We can put other condition. For example, again, we can say case in the case it is, let's say, George. He can say message box. Welcome George. So this is really easy. Let us check this. In case I input Ali, it's gonna say welcome Mr. Ali. And if I input George, it's gonna say welcome George. And if I input anything else, let's say um, Dracula, Dracula, it's gonna say incorrect username. Now let us have another example which would be a different way of handling case or select case. Let us get started. So there is an input box asking the user to enter his marks. When the user enters his marks, if the marks are from 0 to 32, he's going to get a message saying you have failed. If it's 33 to 50, it's going to say you have passed with D grade and again so on. If the case is not among these numbers, then it's going to say incorrect input. Let us check this. Let's say 55. You have passed with C grade. And if we see 55 to 51 to 69, so 55 comes in here is with C grade. And if I type 25, it's gonna say you have failed. And if I type 103, it says incorrect input. This is a really good program. So let us go to the third way. So now we are gonna check whether today is a weekday or not. We are gonna say. So in case it is Saturday or Sunday, well basically what I wanted to show you is that you can have multiple conditions in here. Let us go to the next problem. So last example which I have taken from a particular website and that example is this. So we can say. So if the value is less than 100, it's going to say north. If the value is less than 200, it's going to say south. If the value is less than 300, it's going to say east. If the else, it's going to say west. Simple as that. This is the condition. Let's say 59. Sorry, less than 100 is north. Let's say 105. It's going to say south because less than 200 is south. Okay, guys, I'll see you in the next tutorial. Thank you very much for watching.